Well, first of all, I don't think biological sex is defined in terms of chromosomes. Um, but let's just use the example of water. Maybe we could agree that water is H2O. Um, that was true even before we knew about chemistry. Oh, no. That was the definition of water before anybody knew anything about chemistry, before we knew about H2O. Back when Aristotle thought it, water was just an element. Nevertheless, this it was H2O. True. I'm sorry? This isn't Go true. That water has not always been H2O? Yeah. All you have to do is cross the Mexican border. And over there, it's aqua that's H2O, not water. Aqua means water. Aqua is water. <laughs> A different they, uh, actually it's <laughs> oh no and it falls apart for me really right this is where it goes really really bad uh it, it's supposed to be eight minutes i came prepared to talk for eight minutes but again that that's my fault right i, I came uh unprepared for that what would be the wrong way to teach about the civil war well again the wrong way to teach about the civil war is to frame it as if white people are inherently evil and that um because of colonialism um essentially they you know, dominated the chessboard of the world and that everybody's life, it, it, you know, is bad because of white people. That That's the wrong way to teach it. And that is what, that is the argument that some is it people inaccurate? are making. I think that it is inaccurate because I think when you look at the lens of history, there are winners and there are losers. And I feel like some people seem to be more upset about the fact that uh, European colonialism was successful for a certain period of time um, rather than actually being upset about so-called racism because- what Something like a right-handed person. Do you think that's a social construct? Um, abs wait, absolutely. Yeah. People can Do you use think right and left, left are social constructs? Um, like in the sense that they're relative, like to you, I got, but like broadly, not really. No, though. Actually. Yeah, I would say so because you can <laughs> argue like is left or right a deliberate direct. <laughs> oh. Is it, is that a contradiction as being atheist? And no, Muslim I would not see that. It's not a logical contradiction. contradiction. No. It's not a logical contradiction no. to be an atheist and a Muslim at the same time. No. Right. I, w I need you to hear this. Oh, geez. Okay, so this is what's going to happen. I t what did I tell you? He was going to do anything he could to avoid... Oh! Oh, there he is! Oh, no! Sam Cedar! What a, whoa, no. what a fucking nightmare! You, I had no idea this was going to happen. I thought, I thought Ethan was a stand-up guy. This is oh, where we wow. are. Yeah, I told... Dave, Dave, remember I told you? I told you... I said, this is, I guarantee you, he's going to do anything he can to avoid the debate. Well, I just think he believes that he should debate you. No, no, he doesn't. He just takes advantage of, of women with, you know, mental health Steven, issues. Ethan Klein know, doesn't I, stand up and do to his own I fighting. Gotta say, I got to say, it's hilarious. Let's bring on FM. You would uh, do anything to avoid talking to me. I think you're, the point that you made. Yes, that's really Joe this Rogan. Yeah, Joe Rogan and, and Ben Shapiro. And, and Dave ben Rubin Shapiro. and Jordan Peterson and Noam Chomsky and Sam Harris. Everyone's been avoiding. And not just attempting to get Peter. your audience by jumping in. <laughs> well, I, I debated with uh, Charlie Kirk. <laughs> Stephen, I mean, it's okay. about issues. Let's it's about talk issues, about those yeah. issues. That's I what you're doing here. Valid yeah. points. You're so clever. I, I had no that. idea that you were taking your show off early last time, coming in today with your pig pen peanuts. Eyes. I wish ever. <laughs> You take those off with a velvet really team button. We must have been Black very worried eyes, about this, Stephen. Like I don't know why. No it one's would be, worried oh, come about it. Sam so didn't want to well, do let's, it. Let's have Sam, a debate. Come on, no just, I'll tell you what. I have a general. This. I have a general. This is a rule. great opportunity. I don't start a debate to, based with people on a lie. And how about you get sabotaging? To a, how about you get Stephen, to a show yourself, you coward? Stephen, show yourself. Don't show your co-host. Ethan, you should show yourself. Ethan, how can you respect yourself as a man, brother? Stephen, so Stephen, you are such a Howard, stop debate. showing your little leprechaun co-host who comes right, out dressed right. hey, like Ethan, your sidekick. Ethan, Ethan, why do you have to bring I on a guy who is the 30th I'm of the really viewers? Why is thing I've ever heard? So you Just have a guy Steven. with less viewers to come on to debate him because you can't? <laughs> Well, obviously, if I'm a apparently if, obviously I'm a if I'm a layup yeah, and not a debater. Well, look, yeah, you're the I one mean, who you're called. The one you're the one who got debate. Stephen, the one that got angry about. Show it. Stephen, you're don't be such a, a coward. All right, hold on. So let me let All me right, let me hear what it. let me hear what Pete Penn has to say here really quick. Fair enough. Show, but Ethan, Ethan, look, I I don't hold on a second, Ethan. This is because initially I came on here to talk with Ethan. Ethan, come on, man. Look, the same reason that I haven't ever had a conversation with Sam Cedar is the same reason that uh, Joe Rogan, uh, Sam Harris, Brett Weinstein, Dave Rubin, Ben Shapiro don't own anything. It's based on a lie, Ethan. Just what's like you lie? claiming my Ethan, what's the lie? You claiming my what's Booker the lie, reached Stephen? out to you, Ethan, when you Stephen, know that's not true. 
There's no What's one the ducking you, Why Sam. You I've so never afraid. Sam, Yo, Sam, listen, Sam, Sam, I think Sam, you're Sam. a smart guy. I can call out Mike I don't Tyson. Understand why it doesn't mean that I'm ducking him. You are so worried about this. Why do you I feel that? Why don't. do you feel that anyone, Sam? Why do you feel that anyone owes you airtime when you have a fortieth of the audience and you've been doing the show? I don't think anybody owes me airtime. I think I think that Ethan has just given it to me. I didn't right. ask him for it. And right. so no, you've been begging the for real it for a long time with everyone Stephen, bigger than why yourself. Are you so yeah, he found you about can't build an audience. And so what why happens is he uploads so 15 about, times more, do you think has your less than a 50th says, of the audience. Well, that's why he wants to debate you is so he can build his Sam, audience. Do you Sam, think come on, your where's... audience cares yeah, yeah. that I only have a million subscribers and you have what, six or seven million subscribers? Let me answer. Can I answer your question? Can I answer your question? Can I answer your question? Sure. You want me to answer your question? My audience would say Sam who? Just like Joe Rogan's audience and Ben well, Shapiro's and Dave know Rubin. Now they all know who I am. Now they you all know who you are because you had to show on yourself and do another coward show. College, college another students, show. every day that you do that, <laughs> Why uh, change we, my hold mind. On a second, hold they on a second. don't know who those college students are. This is another lie. This is another lie. Let me, let me clarify, be? Sam. Let me clarify, Sam. The change my mind, everyone knows on the show, right? We've had professors on the show. How did you know I ended my show early last week, Stephen? If your audience doesn't even know me, how did you and and half you of your that? staff doesn't Do you like watch my you show? because I'm a diehard fan. Yes, it's because I he's a diehard well, fan. If you're yeah, a I've die heard hard of you, fan, but I just why, met you. Why not? Congratulations, have me Sam Cedars fan. And Stephen, have a, a conversation. Huge fan. I, I will like, talk right about every time I try and talk, you you're interrupting, talk about, Sam. Steve, yeah, anytime, right now, I'm anything. trying to talk with you. You're interrupting, you bombarded Sam. bombarded the show. Okay, you, bombarded, you bombarded my show under a false pretense. You claimed bombarded. that ever, just like you claimed that I ducked a debate with you under a false pretense. Have I uh, ever? That is what the Politicon people told me. Oh, is that what the they told you? Well, so I, you're just lazy yeah. with your research? And if no, big tech what, is, you continue with the I lie. Need. You need to research to say, did Stephen ever accept? They, they said you were let me, let me explain to you. Let me explain they to you. Let me explain to you. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Sam, and you literally Sam, 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 sweetheart. Spirit. Sam, fake stand-up comic who we can't find any footage about online. Let I'm me finish. I'm not a stand-up comic. Oh, you're not. Okay, that makes sense because everything that I've seen is incredibly unfunny and unentertaining. Well, which may I'm explain the audience. Irony, irony alert, Stephen. Comedian. Comedian. My stuff, the Stephen. Irony that you alert. Sam, that your can I answer your question? Appreciate our, Sam, our, our discussing Sam, things. Sam, Samuel, can I answer your question? Yes. So you have gone on. You've done the same thing with other other comments. Everyone who has a bigger audience than you, because you said I want to speak with Stephen Crowder. You believe that at some point there was some acceptance. When have I ever done a, a, a Politicon? Ever. I when don't I, know. As a matter of fact, I in the last decade, like in the last decade, in the last decade, I haven't done a single political conference. How I hosted CPAC say, for four years and stopped because they suck. How they don't say, pay okay. and they're full of losers. What about and you've been McGinnis clamoring show. for it. Gavin and it's a lie. told me that you dropped out of doing how his show because you, this is just you saying go. gossip. How can I've you never met more of a woman when he wants to keep debating. I don't know. Let's talk about the issue. So, Ethan, do you want to have a conversation, Ethan, about the vaccine? Because Ethan, you were, do you absolutely, want to have a conversation I do. You're going to hide. You absolutely, so I do. About, so why are you hiding behind San Cedar? San oh no, Cedar. no, no, no me and Sam are lined. I'm not hiding. Him. He just well, you're just no, a liar. So you're Ethan, a liar. Because remember, we said, hold on a second, hold on a second. Yeah, I mean, it yeah, sort of yeah, feels yeah. like it's you ridiculous. guys are the ones who are hiding. Really? Ethan, really? No, no, this is actually who's snuck in on you? Who's the guy who never appears on stage, never does a live show, but is never even sheds, never even allows a shadow of comedy to be perceived on his program? It's just hiding. Everything we do is out in the open. H three, H three. You know, you're wearing a holster. We agreed. So what? Hold on a second. Yeah. So. I want to normalize uh, responsible gun ownership. Is that your debate? No wonder you had to bring in a hack for you. you. Well, no, you're talking about right comedy. Well, that's I mean, you know, that's right not very funny. funny. You're a holster, bro. Also, you're a holster. 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 All right, Sam. You got it. You got it. I hope you have a wonderful highlight reel. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just make one point. Hope you enjoy Politicon. Hold on. Let me make one point, Stephen. Take it easy. Steven, right, don't thanks, bail. Guys. Don't, I appreciate don't bail, you coward. Hey, Sam, one thing before I go. One thing before I go. Can you take off your glasses? Steven? Hold on. One thing before I go. Can you take off your glasses? We just want to see. I just want to see if you take them off, if you have the, if you have the Velveteen Rabbit buttons. That's the oh, only thing I'm curious about. It's the I, only interesting part Steven, about it. Or if there's a soul. Let's just take debate. Off the, take off the glasses. Let's debate, uh, Stephen. Don't hide behind the glasses. Don't, don't be a coward. coward. Will, Let's debate, Ethan. You've I lost the coward. 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 Debate, debate the issues. What does it matter who you debate, coward? All right. Good. You guys are good. Thank you. Coward. You won't even take off the glasses. I was right. All right. You can run away. You run away twice. Cold feet again. Come on, Stephen.
Wow. <laughs> wow. Dude, I can't believe he admit to following. He admitted that he followed the show last week. We got him. He admitted that he watched the show last we week. We got we him. Dude, we played him so hard because oh. he, he literally was following. He saw that you went live, dude. We fucking got him. Oh, my God. We fucking nailed him.